how are you doing? I hope you're great. And we have a new cumulative update for preview for Windows 11 version 23H2, as you see here, for 64 based system. It's a build number, it is the latest. It's KGB50322. Eight, eight, and this is we have uh, lots of features and changes and this and this is the last update and uh, if you not don't have uh, as you see now I'm on the Windows Insider program and as you see now here I can uh, go to I'm on uh, I am on the Windows Insider program, but I have some this issue and watch my previous video, okay? My previous video, because I was on that, always it will show me a beta here. I think is 2077, something like that version. But I don't want that, I want here. and. I was do that on this that way way that that I have this update because it's always been better because I didn't uh, can change to release preview so how to like I said you see here I have it I didn't uh, release them yet but I can now release it's not a problem. So watch my previous video if you not uh, get this and do this procedure on my video before this and you will get pop up this cumulative update preview for if you are on dev or canary and if you are stuck in dev canary or whatever and we have here cumulative update for net for framework 3.5 and 4.8.1 for Windows, of course, 11 version 22H2 for 64 base. It's page number 5032 007. So, guys, watch my previous video. This, if you not have uh, this, and it will automatically in the registry here will uh, turn you change you to release preview and you will get this update not beta or dev or something you will go to release preview okay and i will leave a link in the description so that will be all for now so guys thank you for watching and